In this video I'm going to go through Kirchhoff's voltage law and how to calculate voltage drop in a series circuit. Now here's an example for you and I'll demonstrate. So if we've got 20 milliamps of current and we've got 100 ohms, 200 ohms and 300 ohms in our circuit on separate resistors, we have to use V equals I times R or voltage equals the current multiplied by the resistance. So in this case, because we've got 20 milliamps, we have to break that down to its unit, which is amps. So 20 milliamps is converted to 0 0.02 amps. Multiplied by the resistance, in this case, against resistor 1, is 100 ohms. So we multiply those, and that gives us a voltage drop across that resistor of 2 volts. Across resistor 2, what we have is 200 ohms, so same formula, voltage equals current by the resistance. So we have 0 0.02 multiplied by the 200 ohms, and that gives us a voltage drop across resistor 2 of 4 volts. Resistor 3 is 300 ohms, same formula is 0 0.02 multiplied by the 300 and that gives us a voltage drop of 6 volts. Kirchhoff's voltage law states that the sum of all voltage drops equals the supply voltage. So with this example that we've just calculated, let's see how the formula works. The supply voltage is equal to voltage drop 1 plus voltage drop 2 plus voltage drop 3. So 2 plus 4 plus 6 we should have a supply voltage of 12 volts.